All right guys, so today we're gonna be heading to Crater Lake. I think it's about 250 miles away and this is probably gonna be the longest road trip so far um, in the Outback Wilderness. So, got our stuff packed. We're just doing an overnight trip, but you know, I over prepare. Got the portable washer in the back, extra gas can just in case, cooler, food, and a change of clothes. I made sure that the car is within spec Tire pressure is good, lug nuts, fluids and everything, so we are set. And it's gonna be about a four and a half to five hour drive, so let's get going. Okay, so I forgot to mention that the wife is driving the first leg, and then I'll be taking over from there. It's pretty cool here. I only need a leg room. Okay, so I'm gonna be in the passenger seat probably for a really long time. It's the first for, for me. I'll update the vlog when we get to the first pit stop. Where's that again? Oak Ridge. Oak Ridge. Alright. Yeah, I just realized this is your first time driving on a long road trip. Oh shit. <laughs> <laughs> We're at, at 5,400 miles. Alright, I'll check back with you guys later. go to that little like window and pay. Oh really? It looks like it because that guy is at the window. All right so it's pretty BS that we can't pump our own gas even though the law is in effect so I don't know what's up with that. I yeah, just uh, pulled over real quick just to wash my hands and it's an excuse to use this portable thing it's freaking awesome. It's five gallons and I only paid like 50 bucks for it. You want to keep driving, you said? Huh? You want to keep driving? Yeah. Okay. Let's go. Yeah, well, middle of nowhere. It's crazy out here. <laughs> okay, we're about 42 minutes away from Crater Lake. Getting 21 miles per gallon. Uh, yeah, we didn't get this car for the gas mileage, but it's a lot of fun. But, yeah, so... 42 minutes and uh, we'll be there. Yeah, if you guys can see that in the middle of those trees, that looks like it's going to the sky. That's the road, which is crazy. All right, pretty sure this is it. We're at a standstill, just give enough room for that car just in case we have to floor it. I guess we'll be here for the next, who knows how long? We're almost to the entrance. So if you're able to come back into the park during that time, show us where to see and we'll get it for free. Do I create a light? Thank you so much. Thank you. Okay, bye bye. bye. Take care. So what nine? It says nine miles to Crater Lake, so we'll be there soon. Fourteen. Still stuck behind the slow outback, but that's okay. We're almost there. Um, I guess Crater Lake is the deepest lake in all of the U.S. Don't quote me on that, but I think we remember looking it up at some point. But yeah, this is it. I don't see a lake. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie, it's a little sketchy. Look at that. There's no guardrail or anything. And I'm not driving. That's why I don't like not driving because I don't have control in those hands. There we go. Damn, that thing is huge. Oh, we found the gift shop. They're just making sandwiches behind the outback here. Now I'm kind of glad I pulled up a little bit. Yeah. At first I was like, am I too far up? But no, because we need to use the back spot. Here. 
god. You don't see those every day. Okay, let's lock up. Back up too. So we're on a little hike. I think it's like an hour and a half. Damn. It's crazy. The lake, so I guess it was a mountain before it turned into this big ass lake. That's crazy. <sighs> Hour and a half, like a little hiking. It's an easy hike. Easy one. Yeah, look at that. Uh, it's called Discovery Point Trail. Discovery Point Trail. 2.4 mile, 330 Should have brought my tripod. Forgot. Yeah, at least I could put it in my pocket. Mm. Yeah, that's freaking insane. Yeah, we've never been here. And we're trying to go to more places and stuff like that. Like, we checked out Painted Hills and, I don't know, just really see what Oregon has to offer. I've never been to any kind of places like this, so it's kind of just surreal. So I don't know what I'm going to do with this vlog. I'm probably just filming it so we can watch it again. You know, look back on these things like memories and stuff like that. I just think it's, it's just so cool. It's an easy hike, two point something miles. There's no way we can make this drive back home. So it's going to be one of those, uh, Overnight stays. We got an Airbnb that we're staying at. Discovery Point Trailhead. I guess it's <laughs> it's one mile there, one mile back. Oh, it's a nice breeze up here. Oh my god. I can't believe this is the deepest lake in all of US. That's crazy, man. I know it's only a mile hike or walk, whatever, but like, I don't know, we're Taking a lot of time just soaking all of this in. This is just crazy. If you're within a few hours of this place, I suggest really checking it out. Look at that. So for anyone wondering, it's, uh, it's 30 bucks to get into the park. And then there's a gift shop up there. That's where we parked. But you could also do like, you know, parking right here on the side. I just, I don't, rather be in a spot, a dedicated spot. But there's multiple trailheads. We're just on one of them. No way we're gonna do both. <laughs> Are we? Not really a big fan of heights, if you guys can't tell by now. This is 
crazy. Look at this. Bro, we're on a cliff. <laughs> we're on a cliff. Sorry, I'm just gonna climb over here. So this is the uh, end of the little hike, one of the hikes. Dang. Took us half an hour to get here, but that's because we stopped a whole bunch. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this is the one of the top um, top sections of the hike, so there's no nowhere else to go from here unless we go that way. But so we're gonna head back, and then I don't know, we might do another trail. We'll see. But this is just breathtaking. This is crazy. Yeah, we're gonna head back to the car and then decide what to do from there should be around 5 or so, 5 p.m. Um, when we get back there. So I'll update the vlog when I can. Back to the car, just trying to figure out what to do next. But that was a cool little, just a walk. I wouldn't even call it a hike, but yeah, that's a gift shop right there. Very, very limited parking spaces here. All right, so we decided we're trying to find this second trail and I'm back in the driver's seat. I'm not gonna lie, I like the passenger seat a little better but I'll update the vlog when we find it. All right, so 20 minutes later, we are at the second spot. Yeah, we're gonna do this one real quick. Two miles round trip, pretty easy one. Yeah, this one's pretty easy. It's just flat and I guess there's a couple benches, spots to, uh, you know, My favorite. Relax. <laughs> just gonna knock this one out real quick and then drive an hour to the Airbnb. This is cool. I'm really glad I'm getting all of this on video. I know it takes a lot of effort to do all this and sometimes I don't want to. That's why I didn't do the Painted Hills because it's not intended for anyone to watch. But mainly it's for us to just to look back on, like I said. So this is really cool that I picked up the motivation to film again. Yeah, this is where we're at. And I'm using the mic, the factory mic, with the little uh, puffy thing on top, the dead cat. So hopefully the sound is good. I didn't want to lug a big mic on this hike since this uh, this fits in my pocket. So yeah, if there's anything cool, I'll check back with the vlog. But if not, then we'll just keep finishing up. Yeah, it's probably going to get dark fast. It's almost six. Some Blair Witch stuff out here, man. Should I scare her? No. Nah. I probably shouldn't. Damn. Look at this. This is crazy. <laughs> Fuck. Mosquito. Mosquito. At the end of the mile, you're supposed to see a waterfall of some sort. At this trail. Oh, there it is. Got about a quarter mile left, and you can really hear the waterfalls from here. We made it. It's cool. Heading back. Ah, uh, man, there's a lot of mosquitoes out. Yeah, that's crazy. I got bit like a few times. Yeah, it's not bad at all. It's a little chilly, but it's nice. Say hi. It's just gonna be us watching this anyway. We're gonna walk to the car, then head out to the Airbnb, and then you get cleaned up. And we're gonna head back home tomorrow with just a quick overnighter. Always wanted to check out Crater Lake. All right, see the car up there, We're almost there. And just like that, back to the entrance. We're gonna head to the Airbnb now. Got about an hour drive. It should go by quickly.
just pulled over to see this. Pit stop. Check out this Airbnb. Just pulled up to the spot. This is someone's property. Look at this shit. Wow. And there's a lake behind it. That's cool. Which is dope. This is where we're gonna be spending the night. That's awesome, man. <laughs> Look at this. This is dope. Let's check out the back. Oh my gosh, look at that. You got your own little backyard too. Such a cool spot. Look, the car's right there. Check this out real quick. Oh. Dang. Get your own spot back here. This is freaking awesome. Look at that. Yeah, so this is just a little studio. The bed. Got the bathroom. Shower. Nice view of the backyard. And then a full kitchen. All right, so just having a quick dinner before going to bed. Pizza and salad and all the other stuff that we brought from home, I guess. Yeah, there's some stuff in there. Cool. All right, so we just finished dinner and probably gonna get ready for bed. We're kind of getting tired. And then wake up tomorrow and then head home. So we'll see you guys then. All right, so it's about nine o'clock the following day. Just doing some final checks before heading back home. But yeah, this is such a cool spot. It's definitely meant for just two people. You, know, you get the, that's a pond, I guess. It's not a lake, right? It's a pond. And like I said, parking. It's just right here. It's like its own, uh, I guess someone owns this entire property and they ran out a bunch of these. Pretty cool. Definitely want to do something like this in the future. Just heading out. Ready? Well, we got a few hour drive home, so I'm going to put the camera down. All right, so we just got back. It took a few hours. It was pretty much fine until we got closer to the city where he got backed up, but so far, the car did amazing. Uh, I think we're almost to 6,000 miles, so I got to do the oil change, which 
I have everything I need right here. So I'm probably gonna spend a couple hours just cleaning the car from the road trip. I hope you guys enjoyed Crater Lake as much as we did. That was a pretty breathtaking experience. I can't believe we've never been there. Definitely wanna go back in the future just to spend a little more time over there. I know we only did an overnighter. There's plenty more to be done at Crater Lake. So I'm gonna go ahead and close out the video. If you guys made it this far, thank you so much for watching. And more importantly, thank you for hanging out with us. As always, I'll catch you guys in the next one.